club called Car Carita, and uh, we were all sitting around the, the winery cottage. It was the first time in, in, in 30 years I, I haven't shared a hotel room. Um, even when I was, we were broke and, 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 and I was the little prima donna singer guy, I, I, um, I, I can't have the television on. I want the blinds open. I was a heavy smoker, that probably that time I was a heavy junkie. And, and, and I would turn the heat up in the room and I'd sit around in my underwear. Nobody in the band wanted to share a room with me. So early on, I could kind of do this thing where, where I was like, I had my own. But when the Vickers came over, I, uh, they keep trying to do that to me in Europe. Like, you will save so much money if, 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 if you'll just share a room. I'm like, I'm a grown ass man. I don't want to share a hotel room. Um, Yeah, yeah. Listen, but um, I'm trying with the Nimkers, and and uh, they're being very lovely about it. But I I, I wake up every morning in one of the twin beds. I look over and I'm like, well, when did I start getting male hookers? And why are they in the other bed? It's always like the first thing that I think about when I wake up. <laughs> The money's still there on the dresser. There they are. That's love right there. That's love. Well, or they need a place to sleep. Like they really, right. I'm, I'm great companionship, great conversation. They're just hanging around to have breakfast. That's what I tell myself. Anyways, this song, uh, Two people. Um, one, my friend Tom. When I met Tom, he was like a, a Coast Guard, low level Navy guy here in San Diego. But because of my politics, I don't get many of those guys in my shows. And we became friends. And now he's one of my, one of my greatest friends. And, and he just made commander in the Pacific Fleet. And um, even knowing Jerry Joseph, which I thought would fuck him instantly. <laughs> Because I'm in San Diego, I, I want to acknowledge that. Congratulations, Tom. Um, yeah, Tom. <laughs> also, this is the first time I ever came home to uh, to La Jolla. My, my, my mom's not home. My dad's not home. It was super weird walking into my childhood house. The Timkers have seen me cry more times in the past Whoa. six days, right? Think I let it out. They're like, oh my god, this is so embarrassing. The, the, the angry troll is, is crying now. What do we do with them? And they like throw chocolate at me and like yogurt cups and stuff. And they're like, please, please be happy, angry troll. Do you want chocolate? This is what happens after you think we're hookers, right? Right, after that. I'm like, morning, morning, boys. And you all go, candy bar? <laughs> See, that is happy right there. <laughs> that is happy. Every morning. Every fucking morning. Yeah, because we even stay in rooms that have coffee. That's never happened either. So we get up and somebody's got to go find the coffee. Because of love of the art. Right. Right? People. Love. 61 years old. It's, it's just all about the art. Um, Hello, Jerry. But we're gonna do this last song instead of an encore. And so, what I would say on that is, I've uh, I am old, and I've played in a lot of different kinds of bands and different kinds of versions of duos and, and whatever. Um, and my wife is not a frothing Jerry Joseph fan. She rarely comes to the shows. You go to my house, there are no like there's no Jerry Joseph posters, no frame. And so we played Portland the other night, and, 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 and we came off stage, and Terry, my wife, was like, that might be the greatest thing I've seen you do in 12 and fucking years. And um, I know that it doesn't cover all the old catalog, and I'm sorry for that. And um, 
but we have more tours to come and things to learn. But I uh, usually being me and being in a rock band means somebody in the band hates my fucking guts. <laughs> um, I don't know if we've got there yet. So right now I just have cats that, that super support me. So Martin Dimkirk. Yeah. All right. I don't. Thanks to the Catbot for giving us a gig. Uh, we love you, Jerry. We love you too, man. That's, that's the point. Jimmy Hedick said only cowboys stay in tune. It's always a good Anyways, this is, this is called Loving Kindness. Um, thanks for coming out, San Diego.
Martin Dimker, Adam Dimker. Yeah. Thanks for the cash, Bob. We love you. God loves you. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. We love it. Hi.